Well, damn. You'll be satisfied by this. Welcome to Bandhavgarh, a forest with an area of 1600 square kilometers, home to a plethora of Indian wildlife. Where I had a total of seven safaris. On the safari, I carried this monster of a lens for my camera, capable of zooming into the depths of the forest. The forest was an enthralling experience. Look at these surroundings. First, we spotted spotted deer. They were everywhere. Next, the tiger's favorite meal. Sambar deer are the largest in the forest, and so many epic shots were taken. This is the first time I'm shooting with a camera, and I'd say my picks were rather good. Meal guy are antelopes, and they look rather like horses. Antelope are not deer as they have permanent horns as opposed to shreddable antlers, which makes them stronger and more usable. And charging towards the jeep, an Indian bison. Bandhavgarh is famous for birding, and I collect a lot of birds on the safaris. Up first, a white-throated kingfisher, an absolute marvel. Black drongos with their forked tails and pristine blue-black color, lapwings with their spindly legs and ring-necked parrots with that awesome red and green. There is so much variety, and the sounds of the forest, the jungle babblers. Oh man! And now the moment you all have been waiting for, the big predator. The humans never see the tigers first; it's the opposite. But the rest of the jungle gives us clues. The extremely skilled gypsy driver and guide had an ear for detecting alarm calls, which are sounded by different animals to alert members of their own species when a tiger is in the vicinity. A lone barking deer shrieked. It gave us goosebumps listening as a tiger was right nearby. The jungle got louder and louder. Our guide was alerted that there was a tiger headed 30 minutes from our current location. He cranked that jeep and sent us on the most epic ride, the ultimate tiger chase. Numerous jeeps were crowded at the site. and ultimately nothing the tiger was gone a couple minutes ago this is what the other gypsy saw so damn majestic it's sad to know we've named almost every tiger since there are such few left in the wild these beauties were hunted down because we loved them such is human nature Despite us not being able to have a sighting, I was still delighted. These pictures held the visual memories of the forest, but there was so much off camera. You have to be there to experience the home of the king of the jungle. On that note, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Do consider subscribing to show support for my photography and videos. This is ABSE signing out. Take care and see you later tiger.